What's up guys, I'm the Pop Rocker Plays. Welcome back to yet another episode of Under the Influence. Today we're playing Quantum Conundrum. That's everything I know about this game. If I had to guess, I would assume it's a physics game, because quantum, but it could really be anything. So I'm going to go ahead and take my ceremonial first shot, and then we're going to jump head first into whatever's about to happen. Loading dimensions. Once upon a time. Oh, hello. That she had somehow gotten it in her head that he might Is be lonely. Is that John Lithgow? Or that's what she claims. There's no way. So on a oh, you're here? I am here. What was that? I assume that's the guy talking to me. Voice doesn't really match the appearance, but whatever. Oh. oh. Did I put that? Climb up here. So it is some kind of physics game. What is this book? The Wizard of Osmium. So it's one of those games. Oh, no, 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 What? Oh. Did he die? What's going on? What happened? Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't, I don't. I'm confused. Science things. Hello, you, you, you can hear me, right? Jump around a bit. I'm already can. jumping. Do me and yourself a favor and head to the front hall. There's a way to restart the power grid. I kind of just want to hack his safe and take his money. So what? I wasn't listening. You'll have to reactivate the generators in each sector in order to lift the current lock. Got it. Take the glove. In the power glove. With you. I wish you could see my facial expression right now, as I am not pleased. I don't. What you are care. holding, my latest invention that should come in handy. Get it? You know, because it's a glove. <laughs> yeah, so that kind of game. Pop the lever. Let's get in this bad boy. Our rifts existing between various dimensions. Okay. Ooh, a jetpack. Able to develop a power source. Ooh, give me the jetpack. Energy in Why? Give me enough to travel through. Give me. Oh, what? Something about uh, traveling dimensions. Yeah, give me the jetpack. Ooh, a freeze gun. That's cool, too. Do I get to play with all this stuff later, or like, the what's going on? The glove controls and not completely destroyed by an unqualified... You won't have control oh, over well, the ability it, to switch dimensions. It just skipped yeah. the dialogue. I don't know just how expecting me to go up those stairs slower. Bro, this is the weirdest tutorial ever. It's just leading me in circles, giving me exposition, but it's not teaching me how to play the game. I haven't done a thing with this glove. Fluffy dimension. So I can, I guess that means I can pick up the safe. Yep, I lose it when I lose fluffy dimension. Okay, now I'm learning stuff. Fluffy dimension, things are light. This guy's taking way too long compared to how fast I'm going through this, though. Like, I'm picking up on this a lot you quicker than he throw that IDS battery into the receptacle mount. this on battery the wall. into that. Or is it this? Yes. That receptacle okay. will distribute the power source around the room, allowing you to now use your IDS device Ooh. to switch dimensions at your leisure. Okay, so the glove lets me turn on the fluffy dimension. IDS receptacle and batteries. Like, why does a dude need this many suits of armor? Dynamic object linear ligation interface. Oh, it's got a little to face. You, a cloning device. Already to her that explains why he has a hundred suits of armor. Ah! Don't watch me. Oh, you got creepy real fast. Stop watching me. Checkpoint. These are my own particular hybrid beams of carbon dioxide and neodymium dope, yttrium aluminum garnet Bro, just say laser. Okay, so what's going on here? Turn off the laser. Oh, that didn't turn off the laser. All right, so that gives me a safe. So fluffy safe, and I can throw it. But I got to land on there. And I guess I got to avoid the laser, too. Give me another one, bro. Just keep just keep spitting them out, man. So watch the laser and throw it. Oh, I forgot. Just turn off Fluffy Dimension. That's the problem. Yes, there's a, there's a nice little puzzle game hidden under of this all of this guy's exposition. I, I wasn't listening to him. He told me how to do this, and I was complaining that he talks too much. So what do we got to do? Uh, this guy. Spit out a safe. Break the glass. Okay, that was easy. Oh. Okay, I guess I was supposed to go down here. Run back up. And end it here. I'm confusion. Was I not supposed to break the glass? I feel like maybe I wasn't supposed to break the glass. What if I take this off? Now what happens? 
All right, well, I think I broke it. Oh, that opens the door, so I do need a box down there. Just letting you know that you reset the glass. What? How did I, re I reset the glass? Oh, fluffy mode. Reset the glass. Yeah, now that doesn't break it. And now I'll take it. I'll take it on downstairs and drop down because everything's fluffy. Go, go. So it's interesting that you found an entire dimension where that's exactly the same as our dimension, 100%. But everything is made by Cottonelle. So I understand fluffy dimension. When do we get another one? All right, how do I get into the room? I got to do this. If I turn on fluffy dimension, is that a living creature? Oh, it's like a cute little like green Totoro thing. Maybe it's cute. Maybe it's terrifying. Maybe it's going to try to kill me. I don't know. Hey, oh, buddy. That, uh, creature there is an interdimensional I kinetic. Oh, I need the safe. Whoops. Oh, but if I pick up the safe, then I can't get through. So can I? Real quick, do it? No. Okay, looks like we got a puzzle on our hands. So how do I get the safe through these doors? Because I can only carry it in fluffy mode. But if I turn on fluffy mode, this lifts off and the doors close. Does it have something to do with this thing that's leaking? I believe it might. It is quite the conundrum. The quantum conundrum. Hey! <laughs> I can't pull a sneaky. Can I shove it in the way of... Nope. So how do I get something in here? Oh, I can throw it. Oh, gotcha. Okay, so you... I, well, that's too close. Throw it over and then go through. Ah! Just place it and we're through. Okay, okay. Making me use my brain a little bit. In the spirit of having to think at least a little bit about this game, let's go ahead and have shot number two and kill off some of those brain cells so it's harder to think. All right, we're off now. Any chance that we're going to find a second Stop dimension? A yes. And take a look at the painting. Painting. Got it. All right, so we've got three pads here and a battery and a charger. I feel like a major puzzle is coming. Hey, look, there's Ike. Hello. Hi, buddy. So what happens when I press this button? In case you're wondering, you turn on the fan. Oh, thanks for telling me. Yeah, hey! You don't need me to look at him. To oh, I have an idea. And... Yeah! And we're out the door. Hi. Ah, it's Jimmy that's Neutron. Where that got to. Who's that this one? A oh, it's just a collectible. Cool. Now let's do it again. Yep. Let's make it fluffy. See what happens. Give me another. Oh. Oh, it didn't go through. Well, what happened? Can I get a stack of them? No, it got rid of my first one. Oh, okay. Not really sure how that happened, but it gave me a little platform. Dolly's up there. Dolly's going to give me a safe. Let's make it fluffy real quick. Oh, a bunch of safes. And now they're all out here. And one of them sounded like it broke something. I'm fine with that. So I think I need to make some kind of steps from over here. But I don't know how to get over there. Is there glass down here to break? Uh, no, that's a fan. I need to turn on another fan. And if I do that and he spits them out, one, two, three. Uh, fluffy them over. Are they stairs? They are most certainly not stairs. Can I, like, move these around? Yeah, yeah, I can just put them in place. Wow, I was really making that a lot harder than it needed to be. Let's try this again. Uh, that's a little bit more of a staircase, but it's not really gonna help. Can I move these around just a little bit? Yeah. And jump. Jump. All right, there we go. Made it. They're sweltering. In the I right, got the fan on. Air. So if I throw these over, it's gonna make platform. Well, I threw that one too hard. Well, these aren't sticking to the wall. They're just shooting up. What am I supposed to do with that? Can I stand on it as a normal safe and then ride it up? 
Yeah! Alright, that's cool. That's cool. Whoa, something broke. Alright, so I've played through like six of these puzzle types now. None of them have been interesting. You probably this won't see any of This is one of the animals that Dolly clones but, uh, rather... Well, intriguing. But results. I'd really, really appreciate getting a new dimension now. Like, I feel like I've explored the fluffy dimension as much as possible. I'm ready for something new. Ah, you've moved on to a part of the manor where another type of dimensional rift is accessible. Ah, this here we go, the, the next dimension. Ultram dimension. Or heavy, for short. Okay. Well, this is a very big room. I'm already intimidated. Hey, look, that guy's like, he's like the bird. Ah, what's going on down here? There's a lot of dollies. There's Ike. I love Ike. And what's up? And all of the pads. Okay. So if I press this button, you're going to give me boxes. Is it going to be enough boxes or is it? Oh, they got heavy. Now, if I do this again, are you going to get rid of the three boxes I already have? Yep. Yeah. See, they all go through a whole maze over to here. Now, just imagine. Ah! It's these three. So let me follow them. Oh, whoops. I was wrong. I thought that by powers of deduction, I had solved it. Guess I still got to do the hard work here. And here we go. Okay, well. Well, I can't jump up there. I wonder if I can just take these cardboard boxes and just make some steps. I'd help you. Oh, it's too light. I'm knocking everything over. Am I falling off because of the step, or am I falling off because it's heavy? What if I can do it when they're cardboard? I can't land it now. Ooh, can I do it from up here? And jump. Got it. Got it. Got it. Done. I made it. Okay. Okay, big puzzle room. Press the button. What do we got? Nice job. Whoops. No. Big puzzle room. Let's make it fluffy. I can't make it fluffy anymore. Oh, I can only make it heavy? Okay. Heavy. With the increased density and higher okay. points of items in heavy dimension, quadrangle laser. Heavy stuff doesn't get burned by lasers. It's easier than whatever you're saying. What's up here? Some glass I need to destroy. Where is that going to? Whoa! Okay, if I unheavy it. It'll make it stairs? Okay. Well, I kind of figured that one out on the fly, but I'm okay with it. And a battery. Hi! I came Hi! No, stay here. I like you. So I can put this in, and now I can make Fluffy. Yeah. I believe I stole these and hid them at one point. I don't need a background on where the collectibles came from. Okay, so I gotta get through these lasers, I assume, with these boxes, so I can fluffy them and bring them over, but they're gonna get cut by the laser. Okay. Does that work? Is that all I need? Alright. Not half bad. I thought that was gonna be more complicated than that. Ooh, a blue laser. So he gives me a battery. Well, I want the battery. Whoa! He gave me more than a bat. What's going on? Move that if you What's disrupt the blue, the blue beam, it should deactivate something. Uh, blue laser is power. Okay. So how do I move these over without them blowing it? Can I, I drop it over here, and then I'll come grab one, and then it'll blow over, and I'll stop it with the other one. And not even close. Is there something else I can do in here? Oh, I've got to get to that battery. That was easy. Thank you, Ike. Like that. There we go. Now I... How do I get in here? I don't... Is it going to give me something else? Oh, it got rid of the thing. No, stop. Now I'm going to go do it all over again. So I need some way to take the box off and open this door so I can get in there. Oh, duh. 
He looks like he has the head of a bat on a teddy bear with eyes that sear my soul. I keep wanting to take it down. That's look. exactly what he is, except his eyes warm my heart. You cold, soulless monster. 